one of the best memories of my life. It's not my career, but my life. I remember watching the first grand final when Jason Robinson stepped through the line and scored and watching that occasion at home with my family and thinking, wow, I'd love to be there one day. That's amazing. be on that stage and to end up scoring a try is it's all I've ever wanted to do in my life, if I'm honest. I think it started off the year really, really difficult. I think we, uh, we'd lost it to All FC in the Challenge Cup, which you know we'd like to progress further. And there were a lot of guys that were coming off contract, so it was really difficult. We had Apache really indifferent staff for, for the Bradford team of that era. We were. Um, you know, we're expected to win a lot of games, but during the season we, we, kicked, we picked up a bit of momentum and by the time that people started to announce where they were going ne the next year, we kind of come to a, to a togetherness, a bit of togetherness. We, we got to a point where I think JP came out and basically said, listen, I've signed for Leeds. I, I came out and said, I've signed for um, St. Helens. I think it was Stuart Radin and said he was going to Warrington. And Rob Parker were going to Warrington. And, you know, that was, and then Robbie was going to Huddersfield. And by the time we all talked about that and it came out in the open, I said, listen, this is our last chance together as a club, as teammates. Um, let's, let's finish on the best, in the best possible way. For a large part of the season, there were a lot of, you know, by, by no means probably did we think we were going to win that trophy at the start of the season. By the midway point, we were, you know, there were a lot of stress, a lot of stress, ups and downs, and and then by the time we, you know, we put these people signing contracts and moving on to bed, and we'd had a, I think, remember we had a really good drink. We went out on a big fancy dress day. We had a massive session, full day session, and we all said to each other, we're going to do it for each other. I got a lot of things off his chest, and from that day, I knew that we were, we were we were in with a chance at least. We did get a little bit lucky at the time because I remember the game that um, Saints were probably the informed team that year and Longy and Gilly got injured in the same game against Wigan, I think it was. You know, Saints were at a real tough end of the year and whereas we were coming, we were fully fit uh, and full of confidence. So, you know, it's not saying that we couldn't have beaten, but, you know, we'd rather, <laughs> we'd rather have had the run that we did. Um, so, yeah, we got, a tad lucky with Saints being depleted, but it is what it is. You've got to manage your squad and manage your team on the on the day. Um, and you know we were we were the form team to beat, and we beat Saints in the semi-final. And I remember Shantaine scoring over it left hand corner to, to seal it, um, and then we went on to play Leeds in the final. Part of the reason we're leaving was I'd, I'd been sick of being a utility player and. Part of that is I wanted to be a little bit closer to the ball, so to be on the ball a bit more. Um, so nobody just said, you know, we'll put you on the wing to get you in the team somewhere, which is better than being on bench or not playing at all. I picked up some good form, to be fair. I'm, you know, so I were in some of the best, my best form that I'd played in my career in the back end of that season, even if I were on the wing, I was playing some good rugby. So it was just, you know, it was just probably a, a knock-on effect of building confidence throughout throughout the year. No matter when you play Leeds, and especially when you're playing for Bradford, it's it's going to be a tough game. For me personally, they've been out worse than losing. Well, <laughs> there is there's no worse than losing to Leeds in the grand final for me, being a Bradford lad. Um, I've had it a few times playing for Saints, but luckily for the, I didn't play in the 2004. The first points of the grand final. Deacon, man of the match here in 2002. Deacon then long to Leon Price. Oh, it's opened up for Leon Price. It has opened up for Price. And Leon Price scores for Bradford. The defence was waiting for the pass out wide. They moved across to the right. And there was a hole there that Leon Price could have driven a double decker bus through. I just remember the ball played over on the right hand side, touchline. And I think Deeks were at first receiver. And he just gave me this like 30, 40 metre spiral. 
pass that landed right on the button. Um, and I got it and just immediately started running. The defence seemed pretty, um, they were on a bit, of, a bit of a back foot. And I think I just, I don't know if I was show and go, but as I did, I, I, the ball popped out of my hands for some unknown reason. And all I could think in slow, we were going in slow motion, is like, I'm through, but I'm going to lose the ball. And then the ball popped up and luckily I just managed to regather it. I don't know how it, why it popped up. And I think I went through Cine and Chev and then uh, Calderwood tried to come and knock the ball. Luckily, I dived to the floor quickly enough to score, so yeah, it was just a good, good memory. Not the best to Langley, had to stop. Langley, no! Langley! Still going! They're falling off the Leeds defenders. Langley! I've been through quite, you know, some difficult times as well. A lot of difficult times with things that had happened to me off the field, you know, which were, you know, down to me and my obviously what I'd caused. So I'd, I'd caused my, my family a lot of quite a bit of heartache, so to, and put them under a lot of stress, and my wife and obviously and you know my in-laws as well. But to, to to get that on that, that stage, I was thinking, you know, they'll be they'll be happy for me now. So it were nice to to lift it for them. The Bradford Bulls are the champions. Whilst it's nice to win individual accolades, I've played in some special teams, the Bradford, Bradford teams, 2003, we won the quadruple, Saints 2006, we won the quadruple, so it's nice to get them individual honours, but I've played in, in, in the eras and in the teams of very, very lucky and very special, special teams.